given eight power x minus two is equal to forty eight. So we have to find out the value of x here. How we can find out the value of x? Let's see solution. Eight power x minus two is equal to forty eight. So we can write this one eight power x divided by eight power two. It, when it will go in denominator, so eight power two is equal to forty eight. Now eight power x divided by eight power two is sixty four is equal to forty eight. And now if we are doing here cross multiplication, then we will get eight power x is equal to forty eight into sixty four. Now we have to find out the value of x, so we can take here log. So taking log on both sides, we will get here eight power x log of log of eight power x is equal to log of forty eight times sixty four, right? Now we have to cancel this log, so we can do here one thing. First, we are applying a formula that is log of a power b. Log of a power b, if it is given, so formula is log of a power b is equal to b log of a. So, using this formula, we will get here x log of eight. So, x log of eight is equal to log of forty-two. Sorry, forty-eight times sixty-four. Now, now we have to cancel this log it because we have to find out the value of x. So we can divide here by log it. Divide on both sides by log it. Then we will get here x log of it divided by log of it is equal to log of forty eight. Times sixty four divided by log of eight. Now log of eight, log of eight, it will become cancel. So here x is equal to log of forty eight times sixty four divided by log of eight. Right. Now we can separate this term. Before separating this term, we have uh, we have to apply here one more formula that is log of a times b. If log of a times b is given, so we can write this log of a plus log of b. So using this formula here, we can write this one log of forty eight plus log of sixty four. So x is equal to log of forty eight plus log of 64 divided by log of 8 right so log of 48 plus log of 64 divided by log of 8 now we have to separate this term so log of 48 divided by log of 8 plus log of 64 divided by log of 8 log of 64 divided by log of 8 plus plus log of 64 sorry this one is here so log of 48 Divided by log of eight, right? Now, so we can write this sixty-four. X is equal to log of sixty-four. So we can write this one log of sixty-four is eight square. Eight square is sixty-four divided by log of eight plus log of forty-eight divided by log of Eight, right? Now again, same formula: log of a power b. Log of a power b is equal to b log of a. So we can write this one: two log of eight divided by log of eight plus log of forty-eight divided by log of eight. Now from here we can cancel this term log of eight divided by log of eight, so we can cancel this one. Two plus now here log of forty eight divided by log of 
8 right now is equal to 2 plus log of 48 so this log of 48 we can write here uh, 8 6 of 48 8 6 of 48 divided by log of 8 Again, same formula log of a times b is equal to log of a times b is equal to log of a plus log of b. So, using this formula log of a plus log of 6 is equal to 2 plus log of 8 plus log of 6 divided by log of 8. Now, is equal to 2 plus log of 8 divided by log of 8. We can separate this term. So, log of 8 divided by log of 8 plus log of 6 divided by log of 8. Now, log of 8 divided by log of 8, it will become cancelled. So, here it will 2 plus 1 plus log of 6 divided by log of 8. Now, 2 plus 1 is 3. So, 3 plus log of 6 divided by log of 8 is equal to 3 plus. Now, this is log of 6. So, we can write here log of 2, 3 is a 6 divided by log of 8 is equal to 3 plus. Same formula log of a times b is equal to log of a plus log of b. So, here log of 2 plus log of 3 divided by log of 8 right now is equal to 3 plus log of 2 divided by log of 8 plus log of 3 divided by log of 8 now is equal to 3 plus log of 2 divided by this is log of 8 so this 8 we can write 2 cube so log of 2 cube plus here it will become log of 3 divided by log of 2 cube right so is equal to 3 plus this is log of 2 divided by 3 log of 2 plus log of 3 divided by 3 log of 2 3 log of 2 now we can write this one log of 2 divided by log of 2 so it will become cancelled from here is equal to 3 plus 1 upon 3 this is here 1 upon 3 1 upon 3 plus log of 3 divided by 3 log of 2 now is equal to we can take here LCM so we will get here 3 times 3 3 is a 9 plus 1 plus log of 3 divided by 3 log of 2 is equal to 9 plus 1 is 10 divided by 3 plus here we can separate this term 1 upon 3. So, here we are taking 1 upon 3. 1 upon 3 times log of 3 divided by log of 2. Log of 3 divided by log of 2. Or is equal to, we can write this one, 10 upon 3. Or you can say, if uh, we can write this one, 10 upon 3 plus 1 upon 3 times log of 3 to the base 2 log of 3 to the base 2 or is equal to we can take this common so 3 here 10 10 plus log of 3 this one log of 3 to the base 2 this is the value of x so we can say here x is equal to 10 plus log of 3 to the base 2 divided by 3 this is the solution. Let's verify this correct or not. Now question is 8 power x minus 2 is equal to 48. 
we have to substitute value of x is 10 plus log of 3 to the base 2 divided by 3. We have to verify this value for this equation. So let's start. 8 power x is 10 plus log of 3 to the base 2 divided by 3 minus 2 minus 2 is equal to we have to verify this so question mark 48 right now we can write this one 10 power sorry here 8 power now we are taking here LCM so it will become 3 here and here 10 plus log of 3 to the base 2 minus 3 to the 6 question mark 48 now 8 power 10 minus 6 is 4 so here it will become 8 power 4 plus log of 3 to the base 2 divided by 3 question mark 48 now 8 power 4 and this 8 we can convert into 2 power 3 so 2 power 3 power 4 plus log of 3 to the base 2 divided by 3 question mark 48 now here power 3 and here this is 3 so it will become cancel so left term that is 2 power 4 plus log of 3 to the base 2 question mark 48 now you can see here formula a power m plus n so if a power m plus n is given so we can write this a power m times a power n so a power m is 2 power 4 times 2 power log of 3 to the base 2 so here it will become 2 power 4 times 2 power log of 3 to the base 2 question mark 48 now 2 power 4 so 2 power 4 it will become 16 16 times 2 power log of 3 to the base 2 so a power log of b to the base a formula is a power log of b to the base a is equal to b so here b is 3 so it will become here 3 question mark 48 16 3 is a 48 so 48 is equal to 48 so here lhs is equal to rhs so value of x is equal to 10 plus log of 3 to the base 2 divided by 3 this is correct solution for this equation thank you